Hi everyone, welcome to AI Product Builders. In today's tutorial, we're going to build a simple LLM application from scratch. Today, we are going to explore the creation of a YouTube blog post generator with the help of Streamlit and Gemini Pro model. This application is designed to take a YouTube playing, extract the transcript of it, provide a nice summary, and also transform it to a well-structured blog post. This tutorial is perfect for beginners who have intermediate level of knowledge of Python and a basic grasp of how LLMs work. Let's take a quick look how the app works and then dive into the code. This is how the application looks like on Streamlit. For this application, I'm using Streamlit as a web interface and hosting it on the cloud. As I've mentioned, this application is designed to take a YouTube link. This is where you paste your YouTube link, extract the transcript, provide a concise summary, and also finally transform it to a well-structured blog post. For this application to work, you need the API key from Google. Let me quickly show you how you can create your own Google API key. Visit the Google Code console and you end up here on the Google AI Studio. So you can click on Get API Key. Once you click on Create API Key, your key will be generated. Copy that API key and paste it in a very safe place. And so come back to that. So now you have your Google API Key. Paste it over here. And also use any YouTube link I'll be using podcast link of mine and paste it here now let's generate so as soon as you paste the youtube link and also the google api key you see a thumbnail generated and also two buttons saying can get summary and convert it to a blog i'll click on get summary so you see a detailed summary of the podcast being generated and also key points so now i can also save this to convert to a blog and you see the blog post generated so the blog post has certain structure it starts with an introduction key takeaways main content and also conclusion this is the structure i've introduced in my code you can use any kind of a structure but this is how the app works now let's dive into the code so let's run down the code first we begin by importing all the essential libraries uh, first we start by importing streamly type st it creates a web interactive web applications using python and then we input youtube transcript api basically fetches the transcript from the youtube videos and then we import the google generative ai which basically accesses the google gemini pro model to which we are using today for content generation and then we start defining the prompt for the ai model this is a very crucial step um, and the prompt has to be well structured this prompt basically what it does it uh, it instructs the AI model to summarize YouTube video transcripts into concise bullet points within 250 word limit, um, focusing on extracting uh, the summary and highlighting the video's key points. And then I've defined a function called extract transcript details. This is basically a function designed to pass the YouTube video URL, extract the video ID, and then we utilize the transcript API to fetch and join the transcript text. I've also implemented uh, error handling to catch and display any exceptions via the Streamlit interface, ensuring that user awareness if any kind of a failure occurs. And then this is where the magic happens. We write a function to generate summary using Google, like Google Gemini Pro. Uh, so the function basically requires three parameters, API key, the transcript text, the prompt. First, we begin by configuring the API key, and then we enter what kind of a model we want to use. Here I'm using Gemini Pro. You could also use Gemini Ultra, and then we create generate content uh, function basically sends the extracted transcript to a predefined prompt, which we have defined above, instructing the model to generate a summarized content piece and we've done the response. Once everything is done, we have to convert the summary generated to a blog post with a very structured sections. You can define your own structure. This function, basically what it does is it converts the AI generated summary into a blog structure. This structure includes introduction, key takeaways, main content and conclusion. This is the structure I have defined. Um, you can define any structure you would like to see it in your application. So this is all about extracting the transcript from the YouTube and generating the content using Gemini Pro AI model. And now we start with 
setting up the UI interface. And from here, we start by setting up the Streamlit UI interface. Um, so first what we do, so we use st.title to set up a title for Streamlit UI interface. And then we pass on the instructions for obtaining a Google API key. As you've seen in the app, we use st.markdown to input any kind of a text if you want uh, on this if you want to see on the streamlit ui interface and then we begin by creating two input fields right one input field is where user enters their api key and the other in input field is for the user to enter the youtube link so once the user has entered the youtube link um we extract the video id to fetch the video thumbnail over here as you see this is basically to create a visual feedback confirmation to the user that the correct video has been extracted we use streamlit st dot image over here to display thumbnail on the image this is optional and then we extract the transcript for further processing this line attempts to extract the transcript of the provided youtube video by calling a constant function called extract transcript details it's a very critical step as the transcript is the basis for our summary and also the blog post and these two layouts are for the buttons as you've seen in the app the first button of uh, is to generate a detailed summary for the video transcript and the second button is to step further by converting that summary into a very structured blog post so these interactive elements are where the magic happens transforming a raw video into consumable content so um this is basically the entire code so you could build your youtube blog post generator using Gemini Pro model in just 92 lines of code. Since we are done with the code, let me start running this and see if it works. Inlet run This is your local host server. Voila, you have your YouTube blog post generator ready. Now that you have your app ready, you can also host the this on streamlit so all you have to do is head over to streamlit create an account once you create an account you can host it on uh, streamlit's community cloud so you see a button called new app all you have to do is um you know to deploy your app paste your github url for example this is my github url and i copy and paste it here you could also select the domain you would like so this is basically generated by Streamlit and you click on deploy. So once you deploy, you see it on your Streamlit interface. So you have the app ready, just click on it. Yes. So it's hosted on Streamlit. Now you can, you can share it with your friends, you can share it with the public and ask the user to have use their own Google API key so that the cost does not incurred by you but the user um so that's it for today if you're interested in more ai tutorials please do subscribe and watch more videos thank you